and it's very typical of a small town. Good morning, everyone. It's a Friday, and the air is super clear. It looks like I woke up today, or when I stepped outside, the air became like, it just looks really clean and really clear out here. It's cool. Super cool. What a great way to start off Friday. Anyways, I'm off to work. Ooh, it's cool outside too this morning, but charge up my battery. Charge up my battery. Um It would appear as though I'm missing my journals. <laughs> Which is not a good thing, but I found them. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a really awesome day. Tonight, I wanna watch a movie. Jenny and Leslie were talking about Guardians of the Galaxy last night. Which sounded, oh, kinda good. Just been having a pretty nice, low-key night. I've been watching um, Shit's Creek <laughs> on Amazon Prime. A show my sister recommended to me and so I told her I'd either probably really love it or really hate it and I'm three episodes in so that's uh, kind of rare for me and who knows when I'll go back to it after tonight I'm just feeling like I want an easy low-key night and these nights are few and far between and it's actually the show is really funny because it's it's about this family who's lost their fortune and moved to this small town because the father actually bought this town a while ago. And it's very typical of a small town. So what I mean by that is like, <laughs> it's almost like set in the past. Like, so it's almost like the main characters, like the family is from the future and they go back to this town and the town is kind of stuck in the past, which by the past I would say it looks like maybe the 70s, which is kind of, I don't know, it's funny, because it's kind of like a theme in life, like where you see, I don't know, just some people, myself included, I mean, keep up with the times and trends in certain areas and in other areas choose to maintain tradition and kind of hold on to the past. So it's just kind of an interesting perspective about, I don't know, so the small town, you know, it's the only job option for the main character in it is a bag boy in a grocery store and he's like an art curator or a trend analyzer so he can't get a job because that's, you know, those just aren't options for careers in small towns. And yeah, I think, and it's just very true of small towns. So it's funny. <laughs> It's actually a pretty good show, but I'm not a huge TV watcher, so I don't know how much um, many more episodes I'll be watching, but it's a good flavor of it, and it's funny, so. <laughs> so. So today hasn't been too vlogtastic, um, which tells me that I need to do something really fun tomorrow. <laughs> <clears throat> or really exciting or really vlog worthy and really adventurous or productive or just cool to catch on tape and something maybe that's cool and would be a fun edit. Not exactly sure what that is but maybe I'll sleep on it and wake up with a really good idea 